What's going on, Hustlers? Welcome back to Hustlepedia. Today, we are going to take a look at Bluezilla's latest IDEO launchpad project launching on September 30th, uh, which is this Thursday, which is GameZone. GameZone is a NFT slash play to earn blockchain gaming launchpad by Bluezilla, the cultivators of 100x type projects like Adapad, which is market cap, started under 200,000. Now we are sitting at 41.8 million on Adapad's market cap. ETHPAD, KCC Pad, Tron Pad, all of those pad projects under Bluezilla's tag lately have been absolutely booming on their IDOs. And this is their latest project, GameZone, which is a NFT play to earn gaming launch pad uh, where you will be able to stake your tokens and be able to participate in the initial game offerings as they are calling them the g zone token is woven into the heart of the game zone product ecosystem designed to act as a gateway to the mini games partner with game zone as well as a qualifier to participate in initial game offerings and initial nft offerings similar to ethpad where you have to stake tokens and you get basically advanced access to initial dex offerings on their platform so we will get into game zone the bullish nature of the project and how to get involved in the initial DEX offering on Thursday the 30th. Uh, if you're new to the channel, guys, be sure to drop down and hit that subscribe button. We come out with brand new crypto and altcoin videos every single day. And be sure to hit that like button. Um, it really helps me get out in front of new viewers just like yourself, and I would really, really appreciate it. Uh, let's go ahead and get into Game Zone. So Game Zone unlock God mode for the blockchain gaming landscape for the first deflationary community owned gaming launchpad. There's a lot to be bullish behind this project. The success of the IDOs of the Bluezilla team obviously speaks for itself with all of their pad launches. Um, but own part of the games you support and become the hero of your own story. So this is a very great looking project from the outside. So Game Zone uses a tier-based system to assign allocations and ensure everyone has a chance to secure an early stake in the most sought-after blockchain-enabled games. Higher tiers benefit from better allocation packages, which may include more or and or rarer NFTs, more tokens, and a more favorable ratio of NFTs to tokens, as we read here, uh, and you will get a qualifier to participate in IGOs and initial NFT offerings. But that's not all. So they have starter, veteran, and god, most, god mode stake levels to be able to participate in their IGOs. So the starter, you just have access to play to earn games, early access to new games, chance of free NFT airdrops, and early access to game zone features. Veteran is where you start getting IGO access, access to IGO with standard allocation, um, and access to gaming NFT offerings with standard allocation, as well as increased chances of the airdrops. And then you go to God Mode Stake, uh, where you have access to play to earn gaming in all the new games, highest chance of airdrops on both gaming tokens and NFTs, access to gaming NFTs offerings with upgraded allocation, IGOs with upgraded allocation, and be able being able to participate in all the first come first serve rounds as well. Um, and you get early access to all the game zone features. So the staking levels similar to ETHPAD, similar to BSCPAD, and all the projects they have launched. Um, you see the staking allocation. This is how you get advanced access to these IDO platforms. A lot of people don't know how to get involved in these like 100X style IDOs. Uh, you basically have to be staking, and, not, uh, and if you wanna get in the pre-allocation basically, uh, where you're kinda like whitelisted. Um, go ahead and look at these tiers here, staking requirement of 1,000 BSC pad, 2,500 BSC pad, and 5,000 BSC pad. You have guaranteed allocation on all three, uh, just the pool weight is a little bit different. So that is how usually you get involved in these initial DEX offerings. And I'll show you how to, what the layout is of the DEX offering here in just a second. Um, so that is the tiers of the staking and the access you can get to the launchpad platform where you have that early access to invest in those gaming projects which have that 50 100 x potential that a lot of investors are seeking out access to initial gaming nft offers early access to game zone products and services uh access to a, a wide array of play to earn games randomly allocated game and token and nft airdrops access to igos and early access to games 
bootstrap your player base deflationary tokenomics this is super bullish here guys so the long-term survival of the blockchain space in many of the projects largely depends on the sustainability of their token distribution model look at their token omics guys this is honestly awesome token burn mechanism seven percent fee for g zone sell orders so if you sell on their platform seven percent fee two of that percent is burned forever and five percent is allocated as staking rewards so that is very bullish for the platform as well as an early unstaking fee up to 25 percent reward mechanism staking your g zone earns you a perpetual income from five percent of the g zone sell fees receive rewards from early unstaking i really really like that for this project and that is an awesome way to incentivize people to participate on your platform uh, for these initial for these igo projects and like you see on bsc pad all the projects they have been launching a lot of bullish projects adapad uh viking uh yeah vikings chain nft launch a lot of these projects which have been very successful on their idos ethpad polker a lot of these projects are very bullish projects on these idos and these are the types of projects that have those 50 100x type of gains and you're wondering how can this token 50 or 100x the public price to start guys is 0.005 cents maximum supply on the um, token is 1 million for the IDO supply at listing is 31 or 1 billion maximum supply sorry I read that wrong uh, 1 billion maximum supply 31 million at listing initial market cap guys of 155,000 and we see the market cats of Adapad, ethpad kcc pad and we can even go tron pad 17 million like the the market cap growth for all of bluezilla's projects a market cap of just 155,000 to start guys that is insane it is truly insane and their team here following the resounding success of bsc pad and the recent redoubling of our cross-chain networks obviously bluezilla very bullish lately and just the incubator platforms and the launchpad platforms that they have been putting out have been doing crazy numbers so how can you get involved so GameZone is an upcoming all-in-one hum for high quality blockchain gaming projects that funds incubates and grows the next generation of play to earn and nft enabled gaming experience obviously one of the most biggest growth largest growth potential sectors in all of the blockchain in the next few years is 100 percent the nft play to earn gaming sector we've talked about multiple projects on this channel that are already going crazy uh, such as gala for example which is already over 5x and it's still in its early stages for example um, just to name a few and we take a look at it is built to provide a close-knit ecosystem where players can easily experience the latest top-notch games and grow their user base uh, and test the latest features before anyone else ido date thursday september the 30th staking eligibility cutoff if you want to get early allocation access if you want early allocation access you need to have your stake in by 5 a.m utc on thursday september 30th guys um, i know for me let me make sure i have this right and i will do this on the spot 5 a.m utc to central so that is midnight on that is midnight tomorrow yes midnight tomorrow for me um is when the staking eligibility cutoff is and then we take a look allocation rounds opened at 3 a.m central standard time 1 a.m pacific time and then five hours from here we're looking at uh, 8 a.m central standard time is when this will release for the first come first serve round on bsc pad eth pad kcc pad tron pad and ada pad that is when just the remaining allocation of the tokens will be available and as you see the allocation they will allow 25 million to each of or 25 million to bsc and ada pad 20 million to each eth kcc and tron pad uh, circulating supply at listing is 31 million g zone market cap at listing 115,000 public sell vesting schedule 10% TGE rest vested over six months so 
very good opportunity guys to get involved in a IDO platform. Even if you get in on the first come first serve round, it's hard to get involved in these. And I know it's confusing sometimes how to get involved in an IDO platform. The public sale token price is under one cent, about half of a cent. Um, so it is a super bullish opportunity to have a 5,100x growth, especially considering this market cap. Um, if you have any questions on how to get involved in these IDOs in terms of staking, if you just want to do the first come first serve rounds, I know these platforms require KYC verification. I know that turns a lot of people off. Uh, but these are the types of projects, guys, that do do big numbers. I'm not a financial advisor and I am not I, and this is all entertainment, just what I am seeing in the markets, things that I'm looking to get involved with, right? Um, you know, you're seeing a bunch of projects that Bluezilla is putting out, doing very big numbers. This is the next one on the list with definite 50 to 100x potential. So let me know your thoughts on GameZone in the comments down below. If you have any questions on IDOs, I'd be happy to make a more in-depth video on how to get involved in IDO projects and which platforms I advise to use for lower fees in order to get involved with these IDOs that do crazy numbers. Um, you know, I am not a financial advisor, as I've mentioned. This is all just what I'm seeing in the market, things I'm looking to get involved in and projects I am bullish on, and GameZone definitely meets that criteria, considering Bluezilla's recent history of IDO successes and the market cap growth that all of these projects have seen, which correlates to that price growth as well. Very bullish on GameZone, and I'm hoping all of you the best luck in getting involved in that IDO. I will leave the whitelist link in the bottom, uh, in the link down below, in like the comments down below, in the description if you want to try to get whitelisted for the IDO that way you have a little bit of early access but other than that the distribution schedule is as follows and you'll be able to try to participate in these first come first serve rounds if you can't get involved in the early allocation um, let me know your thoughts on game zone down below let me know if you would like me to make a video more in depth on how to get involved in IDOs and spot these types of projects and also Leave your comments on other projects I should cover in future videos. I'll be back tomorrow morning uh, with a ADAX AMA wrap-up, recapping all the questions that they are asking as it is in a Telegram group, which is very odd. But nonetheless, uh, we will be up early in the morning, tuning into that, and then we will recap every key question that was covered and whether it was bullish or not for ADAX. So be sure to tune into the channel tomorrow. I'll be back with more crypto and altcoin content. Peace.